As a Power BI professional, you will surely value tools like DAX Studio and Tabular Editor as they are essential for efficient development of Power BI data models and understanding and improving the code that you've written. DAX Studio allows you to query your data model quickly, formats your DAX queries and helps you get an understanding how these queries perform. It can show you how much time is spent in the formula engine of analysis services and how much in the storage engine. On top of that, it can also provide you with all kinds of metrics on your model, the table sizes, cardinality, relationships, integrity violations, fields that consume the most space in the dataset through its Vertipack analyzer. This tool merits one or more videos of its own. Tabular Editor allows you to interact with the data model and change any of the available properties that are not even exposed through Power BI Desktop, like creating calculation groups, quickly hiding many measures, but also has a best practices analyzer warning you about possible improvements to your model. Again, it would take too much time to go in detail in this video. When one day an email appears in your mailbox to join the waiting list for something called Tax Optimizer by a company called Tabular Tools, it's needless to say this could only be a very promising effort. Yesterday the wait was finally over and I received my invite code to sign up for this new tool. They offer various plans that charge either by single optimizer run or two subscription plans, one for optimizing a model in Power BI Desktop and another that also analyzes the model running in the service. Those are limited to 20 runs per day. After subscribing, you receive an activation code that allows to set up the environment. To my surprise, this was not a tool to download or an add-in, but the DAX optimizer is a website. The tool is still in private beta, but appears to work very well. When you log in, you arrive in your workspace where you find the list of your models. A model is a collection of different versions of your Power BI data model to be analyzed. You can add versions of the model by clicking the plus version button. This is actually a Vertipack file which you can create with the DAX Studio tool. When in Power BI Desktop, with your model open, click on DAX Studio, Advanced and Export Metrics. Make sure you are on the latest version of DAX Studio, 3.10 as of the recording of this video. After you save the file, Upload it to DAX Optimizer and it will analyze the structure of your model, without giving any recommendations. It just wants to know what it's dealing with, number of measures, size, etc. Once ready, you can click on Analyze this model and you need to agree that this will consume one of your included or purchased optimizer runs. After a few minutes, the tool comes back with the results and summary, grouped by priority. Click on Issues to get the full list to work on. The nature of the issues is described and the measure it affects is listed. Open the issue to get more detailed information. All affected measures are listed. The code of the selected measure, which can easily be formatted on the bottom right, is shown with the problem highlighted. Expand the issue description to get all details and various examples on how the issue could be addressed. You can also follow the link to the knowledge base. Now that you've identified the issue, you can go back to Power BI Desktop and make the necessary code change. Check if the results make sense and you can export a new Vertipack file. You can then select this measure to be fixed in the model and you'll see the impact on the overall open issues. You can also decide this is not something that needs to be addressed and mark it to be ignored. Upload a new version of the model and rerun the analysis to see if this version fixed the issue. You can always move back to previous versions to see the issues and code of the measures at that point in time. After spending some time with the tool, I was able to efficiently improve my models and notice substantial time savings. I'm curious to see what other functionality the DAX Optimizer will bring in the future, but for this pre-release it already does exactly what is promised on the tin, optimize your DAX.